This is Martin LaMonica with CNET News. I went to General Motors Milford Proving Grounds in southeast Michigan on Tuesday where I got a ride in a plug-in hybrid SUV being developed by GM. While I drove, I spoke to Larry Nitz, the Executive Director of Hybrid and Electric Powertrain Engineering. So the Buick will have this in a crossover, so a similarly sized Yeah, car. similar sized crossover is this, is this car. So it sounds like I'm... Yeah, you're, you started the engine. So it's going to operate uh, pretty much like a normal hybrid, a little more electric drive, up to about 40 miles an hour. Okay. And the idea is you're going to plug in at night, you're going to get the electricity off the grid, and then you're going to deplete it in about the first 20 miles. Why 20 miles? Because we want you to come home empty. We want you to use it all. Every time you go out, 20 miles was chosen as a reasonable amount of time to get the discharge done, pass all the emissions, pass all the onboard diagnostics, which is the biggest challenge of this whole job. We're using the engine so little of the time mm -hmm. that to, uh, to run the actual fuel economy emissions and diagnostic tests, it takes about 20 miles to discharge it out of the battery. So we're running a, it's kind of a slalom core, a city course here. Uh, I can't say it feels any different than the hybrid I've driven. Well, that's good. That's yeah. uh, it's supposed to be pretty uh, uh, not different. It's not supposed to be a lot different. You're running all that city course as an EV, right. which is good. How about the, the feedback system here? I mean, I, I'm, I'm looking at this hybrid dial here, and it's it's not moving much. <laughs> well, it's because you're on a electric in the white. Okay. Um, if you can get that, see that. Yeah. But the electric is white. Sorry, it's okay. the steering wheel on there. All right, there. there you go. And if you, when we step on it later, it'll go to green and then all the way to orange if you drive very aggressively. Okay, so it's a, another power uh, flow here display, right? that uh, shows when it's regen and when it's battery power only. Okay. So now if you lay on the power here, you get the, right. all so, the way into the orange. So this is gas only here. Well, it's gas and electric, probably boosting here at that point. Right. But it's got a, a nice, uh, powerful engine, but smooth. V6 is very smooth. And it does the regenerative braking. It does all the regenerative braking to recharge the battery. Right, when you let up on the gas, it, it starts Fuel, to charge. Fuel turns off and you s start the charging. Okay. The plug-in hybrid like this will just feel like any old it like, It'll like feel a, like, like a normal, car, like right? a normal hybrid. It'll yeah. be quieter in the lower speeds. Yeah, right. I think we've done a really good job on the electric motors. You don't hear a lot of motor whine on all those regens, or you didn't hear a lot of motor whine on the axles. No, not at all. I think it's benchmark better than the competition in my mind in terms of for terms electric of noise, yeah. electric motor whine and noise. Mm -hmm. So we're real happy with how that came out, right. and uh, we'll continue to do that. Yeah, no, it's uh, it was a good ride. Well, thanks, okay, thanks for taking me along. You betcha. <laughs>